I'm here at the Tampa RV Super Show in Tampa, Florida at the Microware booth uh, with Ted Wisman. Good morning, Ted. Hey, how are you today? I'm good. How has the show been for you? Pretty good. We had a big crowd yesterday, 21,700 people came through. Wow, that's a lot of people. It is. So I see by your sign it says that Microware has an easy starter that can start and run my air conditioner on a 2,000 watt generator or inverter. And I know that on my RV, the air condition takes well over 50 amps to start. So how is that possible, Ted? Yeah, you're, you're correct. It's a huge amperage draw in the initial startup. And what we've done is we've, we've made a product here that actually takes that out by as much as 70%. We have a demonstration we can show you. That would be great. Okay, well, we're going to start it up the first time without the easy start install. We'll bypass it. And you'll see that, like you said, it takes like almost 50 amps to start it. All right, here we go. We're clearing the meter. And now we're going to turn it on. There it is. Wow, that sounds about right. My air conditioner takes that much amps to start. So I have to have quite a lot of power to be able to start my air conditioner. That's correct. So let the me... easy start. So explain to me what that is. All right, let me show you what it looks like. Come on over here. This is, this is the, the size of it. It's very compact. It actually goes in the air conditioning unit up on the rooftop and it wires right into the electric panel. Only four wires, very simple to install. At the same time, because we know a lot of people want to do it themselves, we've come up with a small installation kit, which has the exact right electrical connectors and little jumper tie wraps to install it themselves. Well, that's handy. So it's an easy installation, and is it a permanent installation in my air conditioner, or is it can be moved? Well, it is and it isn't. So it's in, it's in nice and tight the way it should be, but if you ever change the air conditioner unit or you sell your coach, you can actually take it back out very easily because it's plugged together in fittings and move it to your next AC unit. That sounds great. Let's move back and we'll, we'll show you what it takes to start it on the easy start now. Okay, so you have an easy start installed in this air conditioner. It's, it's in here, and, and so now, we've, now we've gone to the easy start mode. So we're going to clear the meter again, like we did before, and now here goes the easy start. Notice one light comes on, the easy start divides the starting load, starting the fans and the blower first, then the compressor comes on. There we have it. What, what's the amperage reading there? 14.8 amps. So that's impressive. So that's more than 50% down on the amp draw to start my air conditioner with the easy start installed. Yes. So yes, I can with, now see how you could run an air conditioner on a 2,000 watt generator. But let me ask you something, Ted. I have two air conditioners on my coach. Do I need to install an easy start on both of them to be able to get my to be able to run on a smaller generator? It would be beneficial. Um, the reason for that is it's going to be easier on your air conditioning equipment and on the generator that's trying to start them if both of them are installed. And the other situation is in a RV park, a lot of times you don't get the 50 amp service you need. So you can run two air conditioners on a 30 amp port. Well, that's impressive because 50 amp seems to be the problem. Not only is it more expensive, but hard to find. So if I could run my air conditioners on a 30 amp, that would make my life. That sounds great. So. How much does the Easy Start cost? Well, normally if you go to our online store, they're $2.99, but here at the show, $2.74 today, and the install kit's $9.89. Wow, that's like dinner in a movie. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> that's about <laughs> right, Ted. Well, this has been really great. I think Easy Start is a product that I need. I think a lot of our viewers would need it. It seems to solve the problem that we all have, that on those hot summer days, you can't start your air conditioner unless you can get big time ambitch somewhere or carry a huge generator with you. Really appreciate your time, Ted. Thanks so much. Great. Have Thanks. a great show. Thanks for coming by. You too.